Morning guys, um, as you can see I'm just out walking the dog this morning, um, nice day today, we're actually going to go and play golf at the Obama, um, now most people probably know if you play golf the Obama is pretty exclusive, it's not hard to get a tea time, it's quite expensive, but they've actually been doing some offers for residents at the moment um, due to the pandemic, so we're going to go and play today, I'm very excited, never played it before, um, and I'm going to take you with us, show you what it's like. Even if you don't play golf, it's really nice to see. Um, there's a whole resort, there's a spa there and everything as well. Um, so I thought I'd take you with us, show you what it's like, and um, give you a bit more information about it. So, let's stride on and swing on. So, we've arrived at Obama, we're all checked in, ready to go. Just check out the view, even as you pull into the car park, the view is amazing. You've got Gigantes Cliffs over there, you've got Gomera, palm trees, greenery, super nice. Um, so, I've actually got 50% discount as a resident, so for me, for the 18 holes with the buggy, it's 75 euros. My dad's here at the moment on holiday. He's not gonna get the discount, so for him it's 150. So it's not the cheapest, but is it worth it? That's gonna be the question. We're gonna play the whole course, 18 holes. Uh, we'll have a little bit of a game between me and my dad. Um, and at the end of it, I'll let you know what I think of this course compared to the others, Yolas Americas, Golf Del Cer, and is it worth the money? But I mean, at the moment, it's the place is pristine. Um, everything is just perfect, even in the car park. So I'm going to go in for a coffee before we play, and then we'll get to it.
that's nice really nice so quick coffee then we're straight out what a view for a coffee by the way Gamera palm trees I said it before views are amazing I'm looking forward to this So, even if you don't play golf, if you come here, you know, dress sort of smart with a polo shirt on, some not all right shorts, even just come for a coffee, the coffee's amazing, and these views, I don't know anywhere else that's got the views like this with Gamera and the Los Gigantes, it's everywhere you look is just lovely views. Um, I know everyone keeps saying I say the word nice too much, so today, I'm trying not to say the word nice, but it's very nice. So, first thing we notice, you've got the screen up here with um, all your yardages and everything. It's all there, good to go, um, which is a nice touch. Um, makes it much easier for your yardages. So, we're ready to go. 18 hole match, me versus dad. I'm off 10. He's off uh, very dodgy 26. So, we'll see what happens here. But a uh, nice day to play actually. And uh, I'll just show you. That's why I printed on my ball. Okay. Let's go. Fire away. Playing up to the camera there, he hasn't hit one like that in months. Put the camera in front of him and he fires one right down the middle. I'm not really off 26. Um, I actually made a little bit of a mistake before. Um, when Dad went into pay, for him it was actually 100, not 150. It's 150 for a non-resident if you're playing on the weekend. We're down here on a Friday, so he's only paid 100. So it was 100 for him, uh, 75 for me with the discount, um, and so far so good, really impressed. The views are phenomenal, um, and the course is really good condition.
it's a nice hole this one you've got some of the hotel uh, lodges there you've got a swimming pool and then looking forward you've got more of those lovely lodges but you've got Mount Tady in the background as well Well, so far guys, I'd definitely say it's worth the money. Um, the greens are in immaculate condition. Um, the buggies were immaculate when you picked them up, all sanitized. Um, you get free tees with a bammer on. It's all the sort of little extras that you don't get at the other ones. Um, but so far, I mean, just for the views, you've got Gamera constantly in the background. I mean, look at this now, you've got all these lovely cactuses and palm trees and Tady in the background. So just this hole here, we're playing up towards the National Park, Mount Tady in the background. It's a lovely view that way. Then you turn around and you've got La Gamera right behind you. Nice views everywhere. So you'll see there on the screen, uh, obligatory use of face mask on shared buggy for non-family members. So if you're playing golf with your friends or someone you don't live with, you would need to wear a mask when you're in the buggy with them. However, I'm on my own and it's just my mum and dad in the other buggy so we don't have to. But if you wear planes, something to consider. If you're going to come with your friends, you should be wearing a mask in the buggy. Wanna move my feet. Wanna drop my one. Wanna move my feet. Wanna drop my one. Wanna move my feet, wanna drop my one Wanna move my feet, wanna drop my one So you may wonder, um, why does my mum come along if she doesn't play? She just loves the scenery, um, loves the views, loves the scenery She loves to look at the wildlife you saw just then, feeding the fish um, There's some funny ducks and, and geese feather around as well so that's why she likes to come it's not just for the golf she loves to uh, see the wildlife and stuff as well
nice big building in the background the sandy looking red thing that's the Obama Hotel that's where the spa is all the nice rooms really really nice hotel it's not cheap but really really nice so we're now playing back down towards the hotel there's a nice hole this one it's got a few lakes around a few bits of water uh, spectacular views again though uh, we've basically got the course to ourselves it's empty today which is great we're playing really quick it's uh, good. So that's the hotel behind. Um, it's actually um, it's run by Marriott. It's called the Ritz Carlton. Um, I've just looked then. If you to stay for a night tonight in the standard double room, 233 euros a night. So it's not cheap, but really, really nice. You've got the lift on the outside there. Looks very Moroccan. Nice. So we've reached number 18, we're a bit knackered, it's a long course, very nicely maintained, very very nice, if you are serious about golf then I'd recommend it, if you don't play that much then it's probably not going to be worth the money to you, but if you're serious about golf I'd pay the money, it is worth it, the views are worth it, the maintenance is worth it, yeah highly recommend, very nice course long but very picturesque interesting holes definitely recommend it okay i'll let you go first can you tell them we're all square if you want me to tell them we're all square and i'm not leaving Grab this. And now we'll watch how it should be done. Right. If you like the video, subscribe, hit the bell. Hit the like, I'm knackered. Um, see you at the clubhouse. So, all done. Really, really good. Really enjoyed it. Um, I'll leave the link to the website down below and um, also if you want to hire a car to get to the course it is a good 20 minutes drive from Los Cristianos I'll leave the description um, link down below Sanasti car hire and uh, we'll give you some discount there if you quote Night Strider um, that's it for today please if you did like the video give it a thumbs up 
give it a comment. Do you play golf? Would you come and, and have a look even if you didn't play golf? Um, get the comments going. And if you did enjoy it, subscribe. There'll be plenty more course reviews and things like that coming up. Um, and that's it. I'm going to chill and enjoy this view. And I'll uh, see you in the next one. Stride on and don't look back. Wanna move my feet, wanna drop my one, wanna move my feet, wanna drop my one, wanna move my feet, wanna drop my one.